Nathan, it's hard to believe that this day has finally come and that in front of my family and our friends, um, I get to commit the rest of my life to you. Aiden, you are the perfect words to a song that wasn't yet finished. You are a beautiful orchid that's been found at Golden Hour. Ever since I was a young boy, I remember praying that God would give me someone one day who had more passion than me, a genuine heart for seeing people set free, and a love for worship. On October 23rd, 2018, you stepped out of that plane and my world changed forever. And relationally, you are a restorer, a person of peace and safety. Even if it doesn't benefit you personally, you are moved to restore peace and harmony. And I love that about you. Aiden, you are breathtaking in your beauty. You are more beautiful than the sunset over the Australian horizon and the shimmer of the light across the Pacific Ocean. So now, Nathan, today Ada and myself welcome you into our family and our lives. We are excited, proud, and blessed at having you as an addition to our family. After having learned what you are as a man, the people you come with, uh, the world you envision, uh, we are excited and very happy that this is who Aiden decided to share her heart with her. So welcome to the family, okay? Yeah, Aiden, in all of the years of envisioning this day, you look far more beautiful than I could have imagined. And today has been far more special than I could have dreamed for you. And I'm just honored that you have chosen me to be a part of this day. <laughs> Thanks, Marcus. Is over the years, seeing Nathan and Aiden's relationship blossom into something profound. Um, see, whenever I think of them, I think of a couple, two people that care so much about God's design for their life together. Every moment I remember, you know, looking online, seeing recorded YouTube videos and them making songs together, just, dude, that wrecked me big time. Because just the complete teamwork involved in everything they do together and the dedication, like putting the work in, putting the work in to see God's glory brought to earth and to see his will done is profound. And here's the thing, the world better get ready because God is going to shake this place through those people up there. And sooner or later, Nathan comes up to me and says, there's this beautiful girl who loves the Lord and can sing. I think I'm gonna marry her. And I said, do you know how many guys have come up and told me that? Uh, 
and I'm not sure if you remember this, Nathan, but I I actually had said to him, I said, you know, there's a lot of guys that really think Aiden is something special, and he goes, yeah, I'm gonna beat them all. <laughs> And lastly, I vow to be faithful to you all the days of my life. My heart is yours, my yes is yours. And as seasons change, I will continue to champion the person that you will grow into. I love you. Thank you for being the answer to that prayer of a small 12-year-old boy who hoped one day he would find a woman of his dreams. Until the day that I take my last breath on earth, I will love you.